So what about all those smoking guns? You're aware now that the first time that Toyota was reported found was two days later on November 5. A key scene implies one of the officers may have seen the victim's car days before it was discovered on Avery's property, implying a setup. He did not have the vehicle in front of him. He had a, a plate number that was given to him by the Calumet County Sheriff's Office. And at that point, he took the information and ran it in to make sure that uh, it came back missing. That's a common practice. Even though he said the name of the, the car, it certainly appeared as though he had more knowledge of it. From the information he received from Calumet County, that's the only knowledge he had. And then there was the victim's key that was found at Avery's trailer, but only after it was searched multiple times. He moved a bookcase and, and kind of handled it roughly, and that's when I believe the key fell out. Can, you know, things get overlooked? Yes, they can, and, and in this case they did. It's not because uh, it was planted there.